What's this um, offseason been like for you? I know you are getting college attention and college looks and as both a running back and uh, as, a, as a punter and kicker. And how have you juggled both and been able to keep your skill set sharp for, for all those? Uh, it's definitely been something different than like anyone's ever experienced, just trying to get in the weight room and get out on the field and run and stuff. But uh, just as far as trying to like balance running back and punter, uh, it's pretty tough because, you know, when I lift and stuff with the team, my legs are sore. I can't punt that day. So I usually just punt stuff on the weekends and stuff and work on running back during the week. So with everything that's going on right now and, and maybe you can't get to camps and coaches maybe can't come see you, do you feel like some sort of sense of urgency that maybe I need to pick a college now just in case you know we don't get to have a season, you can't make visits, stuff like that? Yeah, I do a little bit, but I feel like all this will calm down towards the end of the year and college coaches will get a chance to see my film and stuff. I think that will help a lot towards the end of the year. Do you want to do every like, all that in college, or do you want to specialize in one one area? Or? Uh, I get asked that a lot. I think uh, – I would love to just punt in college, you know, that'd be the easy job, but also I love playing running back too. So I'll just have to wait and make that decision later. later. Are there are there schools that not that you're leaning toward but that, you know, you definitely like that that you have a good relationship with right now? Uh, Army and Navy. I talk to them coaches like every day and that Army and Navy deal, that's a great deal. Like all the money and stuff and the benefits you get out of that, it's a great deal. I've been leaning towards that a lot. To see other guys from the area, like the Fortner twins, going there, like Cade Ballard going there, do, does that does that intrigue you at all? To, do you know those guys at all? Or? Yeah, it encourages me a little bit seeing people from East Tennessee, you know, go and play there. It makes me feel a little bit more confident in myself going to play there. So for Oneida this year, um, what's it look like if we are able to, to have a season? I mean, do you guys feel pretty confident in this team this year, and kind of what's it going to look like? Yeah, everyone was a little iffy about us because we lost 15 seniors. But, I mean, seeing the work ethic of the team the last few weeks, I think we'll be pretty good. I think we'll be pretty solid. All right, man. Appreciate it.